Hey guys, Chris Birch here, Entrepreneur Strategies, back in the print shop. Let me get that glare out of the camera. Uh, we're back here printing for the 2020 Democratic National Convention. And because everything's virtual these days, they're actually we're printing up these signs. See there for the convention. And I wanted to show you guys how we take this blank sheet, just a regular two foot by three foot sheet of Coroplast. We're gonna trim it down and show you how to mount vinyl right onto the substrate. All right, so back over here at our Roland uh, 300 printer. We have a bunch of material that we've already printed on the table. Um, Basically, this material prints four images across. So when we go to mount it to our substrate and we mount the vinyl to it, um, we can then trim it out into four. And actually, what we found is easier is to cut your substrate down first, and then you have individual pieces. So then you're not flopping around. You know, this material, as you see, is real thin. I mean, it's extremely thin, and easier. It's easier to manage when you have. Um, you know, a smaller footprint to do that. So let's get over here and measure the larger sheet and we're gonna trim it down. These are gonna be three feet, three feet by six inches. So if you can see here on the table, we're gonna take this sheet. Here is my ruler. We're gonna then measure across every six inches and we'll make a mark six twelve eighteen take our t square see there the t but it's great if you can place the edge of it right along the media and then you'll get a nice clean and straight cut grab our blade All right, so there's our first piece. Cut out, rally sign. And then to mount it, we actually use two different methods. One method is a wet and one is a dry. It's easier, a lot of people will agree. It's a lot easier to mount it on a wet substrate because then you can basically, you, you end up pushing the water out. Let me show you how we do that. We grab our first pre-cut adhesive back vinyl, our masking tape. And the reason why you want the masking tape is you need some some form to pull away pull away from the media because the back the back of this vinyl is adhesive, it's sticky. But you need something to, to help pick it and, and carry it up. I'll show you how we do that. Get your mask measured out, nice and flat. All right. Take your squeegee, push out any air bubbles that might be. You want this to lay nice and flat. And then I'm gonna use what's called a hinge method. And the hinge method is you take a regular masking tape. Basically, you form a hinge at the center of the media. So then you're not picking up this three-foot piece of vinyl and trying to get it on there straight. So now what happens is it's created a hinge in the middle. So when I go to peel this media off, it now has something for the media to ride on. And I peel that off, right? And then I take my blade, cut very lightly on the backing, so that just comes off as trash. And then when I said wet method, we just use soap and water, spray a little on there. And the reason we do that is because when you need to avoid getting bubbles, a lot of 
a lot of people have problem with vinyl. This actually, this method, all I'm doing is pushing the water out. All right? Pretty simple. Let's do the same thing on the other half of the hinge. Get rid of our paper backing. Spray that down. Same method with the squeegee. You just run straight across. And then you push all the water out. And some people have said they don't understand how this works, but guys, water water evaporates. So it's now we've pushed it out. So now the adhesive is nice and clean, no bubble. So what you do, take this piece, let that let that dry a little bit, just air dry. And I'm going to keep doing the next boards. We're doing 50 of these for uh, DC Democratic Committee. And then here is your end result. See how smooth and shiny? So now they have, you know, they're up there at the rallies, you know, the virtual rallies, actually. They're not even doing rallies. Um, so guys, look, this is real simple. Bring you back in behind the scenes of our print business. I'll put a link in the description. Uh, either Create DC or Print Equity. Both of us, we're the same organization. We all produce um, in the same location. So if this guy, if this video has brought value, give me a thumbs up. You know, smash the like button. Subscribe to my channel if you like this content. And please, you know, if you have questions or any comments, comment below. Uh, I'd love to communicate with you guys and maybe figure out methods that we could assist you in uh, your print needs. All right, Chris Birch. Talk to you guys soon.